what is swimming pool shock? So swimming pool shock, I also have a bag of pool shock here, and it is the stuff that kills the algae and that chlorinates the pool. So one bag of pool shock is good for 15,000 gallons. So if you have different pool sizes, how many bags do you need? So there's other companies that make it. This company here is Mega Pool and Spa Chemical Shock for super chlorinate pool water and control algae. That's the company, Mega Pool and Spa Chemicals. There's Clorox, other companies. A lot of pool shocks probably gonna say, and does say, keep out of reach of children, danger first aid. So this is just about if just in case you got swallowed by accident, it has information here. All our pool shock will probably say that. Then there's information towards the back. So what this does, so if you have a really dirty pool and you want to super chlorinate it or just want to chlorinate it made for the winter, this is a good to winterize the pool, all their stuff. There's all our companies out there, you know, Zap It, Clorox, HTH, and there's other companies out there that make shock. And you know for a fact, some companies have like the has the color here. This one has bubbles here. And this is what it says about the grams. Other stuff. Right here, this is hazardous and dangerous too. So this is great for swimming pools and spas too. This will keep the pool crystal clear. How does the shock work? So actually, how to broadcast it first before I tell you how, what, how does shock work. So there's actually three ways to broadcast, actually two ways to broadcast it. Number one, into the swimming pool. So you can throw it into the pool or near the return. The other, the other way is just put it, dump it into the skimmer. So there's two ways. What's it mean to dump it into the skimmer? So you can dump this into the skimmer and have it go for the pump into the filter or just broadcast it in the pool. Some people do that, but I recommend broadcasting it into the skimmer because it's going to do less harm to the liners. This stuff can really bleach these liners here. Right here. It turns... Actually, I have a perfect example of the liner a little bit faded, but... This is a perfect example here. There's some little fade marks from here. A little fade right here. Right there. Turn your liner to that. Just blue or even. There's a little bit of fading on this liner here. White. So what kind of what's the backing you have on your liner? If you, broadcast, if you actually broadcast so if you want to broadcast in the pool, I'll recommend putting it in the bucket and mix it up and broadcast it like that. And the skimmer you can do brawl can actually mix it up to be better. And how many bags of shock do I need? Um <clears throat> whatever so if if you have a 15,000 gallon pool, you need at least one bag of pool shock. If you have pools like more than one gallon, you might need two bags or Maybe a bag and a half, or two or three. <coughs> companies, companies don't matter. There's good companies, there's, well, they're all good companies. And this will not uh, take away from the chlorine tabs that you put in your floater. This will probably also work for saltwater pools too. Not just chlorine pools and saltwater pools. How does pool shock work? So, pool shock, if you know about the chlorine shock, it's like a white graminoles. You might get them in a huge bucket or even a little bag. You put it in the pool, if you have dirt, if your pool size no chlorine, it chlorinates. If there's algae, it kills it and it sinks to the bottom so you can vacuum it to waste or vacuum to the filter system. And there's a lot of companies, a lot of pool shocks are all different. This one's a good, good companies are not so good companies, they all work. And they have always warning. 
So, <clears throat> the shock. These, oh, you can see the find these at your local pool store or Walmart, Target, Amazon will sell these. Some companies, some places that do sell pools will actually also have it too. There's Doheny's, RX Clear, and In The Swim. So, bag of shock. These are a little, you can get like probably like these for like four dot bucks, at least four dollars. That's cheaper than the chlorine tabs, but don't rely on chlorine tabs, rely on these two. Full shock. For if it, you don't want to put dump more than the bag that you need. If you dump more, you're gonna really over chlorinate the pool. And next thing is you don't want to swim while the shock is in there because it's gonna bleach your bathing suit or even bleach be, bleach the bathing suits. If you actually broadcast into the water and it settles, it's gonna bleach the liner. So that's gonna be it.